Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing my review on some of the skincare and body care items from the brand called Vont. And it has been there for quite some time. But yes, I have been using their products for quite a long time and I have almost used up all their products. And before discarding of their products, the empty bottles, I thought of making a short review video for you guys. So yeah, let's get started with today's video. <music> foremost skincare which i wanted to talk from their brand is the vaunt vitamin b face wash now this has been a, such a gentle face wash and this consistency is just like cleanse me but more thicker than cleanse me just like more on the thicker side this has a consistency like cetaphil gentle cleanser and it is made up of all soothing ingredients such as cocoa glucoside side glycerin citrate olive oil sorbitin olive oil and all the like all the surfactants used here is very very gentle also has allantoin d panthenol xylitol are looking out for a very very gentle face wash i think this is a very good face wash to go for okay there are only two cons of this product the first con is obviously the price it is on the higher side it is 545 but this face wash will last you for one and a half months i have tested it completely even though i used it at both the times like during the morning and evening this face wash is suitable for sensitive dry combination skin if you're an oily skin person i think this is a good face wash to go for in the morning time however in the night time obviously you need to use your like foaming face wash now if you are from the sensitive or combination skin type i think you can still get rid of your sunscreen using this face wash but then you have to use your towel the soft towel which i showcased in one of my videos not the microfiber towel the microfiber towel can also be harsh to your skin at times but this is the soft the softest towel which i have shown and those are my hankies which i have shown in one of my shorts videos so you can use that for double cleansing using the same face wash and i am planning to repurchase this face wash i need to complete the existing face washes and then i think i will repurchase this i've been trying this out since december last year and i really really like it the second con which i am going to talk about is the pump so once the product reaches almost the lowest level the pump doesn't like pump out the product i think the straw needs to be longer and also the pump is not very effective like you really need to press harder for the product to come out so those are the two things which i wanted to tell to the brand but otherwise product wise i think this face wash is really worth trying only con is the price and the pump. product which i have tried out is the barrier boost face formula like use this up completely like there is uh, you can't pump out the product anymore so it is almost like finished um, this straw needs to be longer this has the same issue as the art rhythm one so the straw needs to be longer for the face wash and even for this uh, barrier boost because there is some amount of product but still you can get this product out from this like if you keep it inverted which didn't happen with art rhythm because their bottle also broke down the plastic one but uh, i feel uh, like the font skincare line is uh, very soothing and pleasing to the eyes i really like their packaging i really like their minimal font and the design of the package but yes coming to this product it contains bakuchiol ceramide complex biopeptide amino acids this is a really good moisturizer to use at night if you have a damaged skin barrier this is a good one to go for uh, 799 so it is almost 800 it did help with my body repair function quite a lot and yeah i do recommend this but then again it is on the expensive side so it comes at a price of 800 now one bottle lasted for around a month for this one this is good for all skin types it doesn't clog my pores i have an acne prone skin and it didn't break me out it didn't clog my pores which is a good part of one skincare like even the next cream which i'm going to talk about is a good one so yeah i did like this one calm cream i have a little bit of the product left and i'll show you the consistency see and i like the finish it gives a non-oily non-sticky finish like somewhat dewy but it is not like that sticky feeling which you feel with other moisturizers so this is uh, good for all skin types the calm cream i felt is better than the bff now this comes at a price of 745 now let me tell you the story about this so i got this cream when i had a damaged barrier thought like it would calm my barrier damage 
but um, this didn't do much to my barrier damage at that time but this is a good cream to be used on a daily basis but not when your skin is utterly irritated and utterly like broken i think this is not the one to go for this can be used as a daily moisturizer i really like this cream and that is the reason i have used it up and i have a little bit of the product left lasted me for more than a month i would say One though I have an acne prone skin, it never broke me out. Yeah, provided the other products in your skincare looks good, I think this one won't break you out. Okay, the next product uh, which I have is the Vaunt Complete Cleanse Body Wash. This is with 2% salicylic acid and 7% mantelic acid. I have also used this up quite a lot. I don't use this daily, but I do use it sparingly like once or twice in a week on my body. This is a very gentle uh, like body wash and it didn't give any irritation whatsoever. It is a very good body wash if you have KP on your body. You can definitely try this and this has 2% salicylic acid. So even if you have body acne, I think you can go for this. This is even non-drying so it won't dry up your skin even though it has like 2% salicylic acid and 7% mandelic acid. And I love mandelic acid among all the AHAs and obviously salicylic acid is one of my favorites. It comes at a price of 551 and yeah it is worth your money. It won't give immediate results as you know this is a body wash which will give you in the long run. This is not very harsh on your skin so we don't expect miraculous results but otherwise it's good. Okay, the last but not the least product is this Vaunt Vitamin C Water. Now yeah I have not been able to use this. I bought this product when i was having a serious barrier damage and it was not a good time to use this and this is a five percent vitamin c now i still have a lot of product left now this is a very like soothing one i did use it like recently for two three times and yeah it, it doesn't irritate your skin even though you have a sensitive skin it won't irritate your skin for sure because this is five percent beginner friendly vitamin c now Talking about boosting collagen, bright, brightening and even skin tone, I am still, I am yet to test this out. It has geranium water and ascorbyl phosphate which is gentle. So yeah, if you are a beginner, I think you can use this serum. Uh, obviously you can use it at night time or at daytime. Generally it is recommended to use a vitamin C in the morning time. But sometimes if you are uh, like staying in a very very sunny environment, the and you are not reapplying your sunscreen properly it might happen that vitamin c is having a negative effect on your skin and that is why some people like recommend you to use at night time so yeah like according to your environment use this vitamin c yeah vitamin c is more effective during the daytime but you have to reapply your sunscreen when you're using a vitamin c serum in the morning i always try to use minimal actives in my skincare and that is why i'm like scared of using anything which might sensitize my skin that was all about this video i hope you found this video useful if you have stayed until this point please don't forget to subscribe to my channel see you in my next video pretty soon bye